Tanzania has one of the highest youth populations on the planet. In fact, 66% of Tanzanians are under the age of 25, and so that means that there is over 25 million youth in Tanzania. And Africa as a continent is changing fast. Many youth come in from the villages to the cities or towns for education and for work, and for reasons often out of their own control, they end up in the slums and they never leave. Within Tanzania and many other African countries, young people are the most affected by extreme poverty, lack of employment and poor health. All too often, they are the group with the fewest opportunities to contribute to the decision-making process that could actually change this. They are often left feeling helpless and hopeless. We all know that youth have energy and that young people can drive positive change in communities and in countries across the globe. Uh, we've seen it. Our young people will change the world, it's a fact. And within the communities that we serve, there are three key challenges in young people's lives. Staying healthy, achieving a sustainable income, and being able to participate. With the average income for youth under $2 a day, many can only dream of earning above the UN poverty indicator of $2 a day. In February 2017, Lee Tanzania initiated the formation of six self-help groups with about 20 youth in each. The community watched on with excitement. As the youth formed these groups and decided how the groups will work, when and where they will meet, and what they will be called, the atmosphere was optimistic and joyous, with hope that the days ahead could be better than those that they leave behind. These self-help groups for youth support the weekly meetings for savings, for leadership training, for income generation and life skills and healthcare, a meeting for friendship and social encouragement. And the social aspect can never be underestimated in a community where severe economic poverty, sickness and fear has left people feeling isolated and alone. The self-help model applies the proverb that we all know to be so true. Teach a young person to fish and they can feed themselves for a lifetime. The self-help group model does just that. In the space of a year, group members are taught to save just tiny amounts of income, often starting at just 8 to 10 cents a week. They form income generation activities through agriculture, handcrafts and selling commodities, and as a group they loan funds from the collective group and they repay it back to help others with their vision. There's no handouts, no loans from abroad, or sponsorship that is implemented. They do it themselves. So young people are creative, they are open to change, they're energetic and resourceful. And when we help young people to harness their potential, to have a voice and to lead, there is huge impact, it is positive, and we can see the results and there is benefits for all. And under God, this is what we desire for the poor, for the ones that are in the slums being reached and engaged. And we just want to say thank you for your support. It will change young people's lives forever.